Hi, my name is Laura. I'm an artist and I'm going to show you how to make a model of a wing. Uh, what you'll need is something to sculpt out of. Um, any type of clay will work. So, um, first you're going to take a piece of clay, make sure that it's kneaded, and spread it out on the table. I am going to use a rolling pin for this, um, which is going to make it easier. I suggest that if you're using a uh, rolling pin that you also use for eating and cooking, uh, that you cover it with plastic like I have so that you don't uh, contaminate it if you're using something like Sculpey or um, plastic modeling clay, which I'm using. Okay, so I've made sort of a circle shape. I want it to be more of like a wing shape so I'm just going to mold it into that. And I'm going to need the start with the, the structure where the bone would be up top and make that thicker. OK, so I have my basic shape that I want for my wing. Now what I want to do is I want to uh, give it feathers. So I'm going to take another piece of clay, knead it a little bit first so that it's more pliable. And I'm going to make feathers out of it. So how I'm going to do this is I'm going to roll it flat. And then after that, I'm going to uh, cut out a bunch of feathers and place them on top of this other part. So now I'm going to cut these sort of uh, half half oval sort of shapes in a line that I think will line up with the bottom and then put them on and attach them down. So for doing this, you're going to want to start at the bottom and work your way to the top so that the feathers lay the right way. So I'm just going to continue to make different rows of these feathers. Remember, when you're cutting with your tool, you're going to want to cut straight down one more row of feathers. Depending on how you want your model to be shown and looked at uh, depends on whether you're going to leave it like this or if you want to do a back side. Um, if you want it to lay flat, there's no need. If you want to sculpt it so that you can, uh, so that it, you can see both sides, you're going to want to build it onto something and have it sort of suspended from something so that you can, uh, so that you can do both sides and see both sides in the end. So I'm going to blend the edges a little bit. And that is how you make a model of a wing. I'm Laura. Thanks for watching.